Hello friends, in this video I will uh, repair these uh, Logitech speakers and I will modify and I will add Bluetooth with this module. Let's begin. First of all, let's start with the story of these speakers. I bought these speakers from uh, Amazon Return Products and I was pretty sure that I will repair them. But after I uh, look inside, you can look here, some of, of the components were burned. And this I see, it's a short circuit on power. And uh, that means that I can, uh, this cannot be repaired, it's too expensive and it's too much to work. And that's why I uh, found this solution and I bought this module. This was about uh, one dollar. This is very cheap and they say it's very high quality. It's probably the same uh, chip as this and uh, has uh, the same uh, supply voltage. This one works with 5 volts and this one works also with 5 volts. They are both in class D and uh, if they have the same uh, principle and the same supply voltage, surely they have the same output power on these speakers. And this should be 100% compatible with these speakers. I forgot to tell you that initially I wanted to repair these speakers and add a Bluetooth receiver. But uh, I've told you was too much expenses to repair this and add Bluetooth receiver. And that's why I decided to buy this product. So let's uh, analyze this product. It's a Bluetooth uh, version 5. This is a volume potentiometer. This uh, switches its skip before and skip after. And also this uh, can be used as a uh, volume, digital volume. Now let's see how we can replace this with this. First of all, I will uh, remove this input because we will not be needed. Now let's see how we can use this module. This red connector, it's power supply. And these white connectors are speaker right and speaker left output. We received these uh, GST connectors. First of all, let's see how we can mount this module. In order to put this inside, I have to make a small hole here for this peak. I will make a sign. So I measure this uh, metal peak has two millimeters and I made here a hole of 2.5 millimeters and it seems it's perfect. Unfortunately, 
I cannot use this uh, because it's different. This is original one and this one was received. It will be a better look when I will replace this small wheel with a bigger wheel like this one. Now first step is done. I should make a smaller hole because this can move. Now let's get rid of old wires. Before I take out these speaker wires, I have to check the plus and the minus. And the gray one is the plus and the black is the minus. Now you can take a clo closer look of this board. I presume that was a problem with power supply. I will uh, take out this uh, input uh, signal and I will use in other projects. I will put back this uh, speaker wire and I have to find a solution with power. I would like to replace uh, this original uh, supply connector with this one because uh, this one it's uh, easy to find. Let's see. So uh, everything is ready. I've covered these holes and also this hole for the lead with these plastic pieces you can see. I've soldered this speaker to this connector and I've soldered other speaker to connector. Also, I've soldered the wires for the supply. And now let's put everything together. I found this knob and I hope uh, it's working. Yes, it's perfect. For test I will use my power supply. Let's set to 5 volts and 0 0.5 amps for the beginning. Bluetooth mode. You can see the power consumption, it's very low. Now let's connect to the Bluetooth. I think this one needs The Bluetooth device is connecting us successfully. Yes. Now I, I will play some music. I cannot play my favorite song because of the YouTube copyright policy. And I am allowed to play only no copyright music.
I can say that I am impressed because the sound quality is very good. It's a very clear sound. It's not powerful, has only 5 watts, but the sound quality is incredible. Bluetooth mode. The Bluetooth device is connected successfully. Because of the current limitation on my power supply, this device disconnected. Now I can increase the current up to 1 amp. And now let's see if we'll exceed. You hear to the maximum power, sound is not uh, very clear, but on medium, on this volume, quality is unbelievable. If I increase the volume, Now let's make the conclusions. It's a very good sound quality for low volume. It's high quality for low price because uh, a kit like this is only one dollar and you have amplifier and Bluetooth receiver. If you have uh, Logitech speakers like this I strongly recommend you to make this project and test it for yourself. I am happy because I uh, brought to life these speakers. If you have any questions, please put it in a comment. And if you made it so far, please give a big like. Thanks for watching. Bye.